Red Bar. Call Red Bar. Hey, stupid. First of all, that's not Jules David in your chat. You're the only one who thinks that. You're the only idiot who thinks that. Mike doesn't watch you. Jules doesn't watch you. And Red Bar ain't coming. It ain't. Here's why, you fucking idiot. And let me do the math on you. Because I know, I didn't even know they made 1D chess boards. But that's all you know how to play. So let me break this down for you on why Red Bar ain't doing shit. Red Bar ain't doing shit. And not for the obvious reasons. He's old, decrepit, can't move, poops in a bag. His wife is leaving him. And he's afraid to go outside. Those are just facts. Those are just facts. His wife is tired of his shit and is constantly thinking about leaving him, and he's got to stay home and abuse her, allegedly. What I've heard, he's terrified to walk outside of the house because of the repercussions of the life he's built for himself. What I heard, he's got a terminal autoimmune disease that has made him uglier on the inside than he's rotting on the outside. Red Bar doesn't have the stamina to get involved in some other epic attack on anyone, okay? That's first and fucking foremost. Number two, why would he? Why would he? He already, do you understand? The perception of Mike David and Patrick Melton is Mike David destroyed Patrick Melton. Mike David ruined Melton, took his soul. Remember, he's convinced idiots like Luis J. Gomez that they watched my soul melt out of my eyes. He couldn't pull that trick over the over the people's eyes again if he tried. He could never do that again if he tried. People are paying attention now. It maybe seven years ago it was new when you'd like go after a guy. Everyone knows what it is now. Why would he revisit that battle on the chance of rewriting history? He wouldn't fucking dare. He wouldn't dare. He's already got the W. Mike David, for what anyone wants to say, if you ask him about Mike David and NLO, Red Bar and NLO, they'll go, Red Bar destroyed NLO. Red Bar beat Melton to a bloody pulp. Why would he come back and, and even try to put a cap on that? A boxer doesn't come back once he's sick and try to fight the same guy again. He won. He beat Melton. All he could do by circling back and picking another fight with Melton is maybe lessen his legacy of destroying Melton. For what? Chad? 